What are you doing for money? What are you doing after high school? What are you doing in college? What are you doing after college? What are you going to major in? What's your purpose? These are all big questions, right? These are all questions that make the majority of young men uncomfortable. Extremely uncomfortable. Because they don't know what they're doing with their lives. Most men do not understand. Do not know what they're going to do after high school. They don't know what they're going to do in college, after college, what they're going to major in. If they are even planning to go to college, they are completely ignorant and don't know. These are all questions that we should have an answer for. And I will answer them for you. What am I doing after high school? I'm going to the United States Air Force Academy. What am I majoring in there? I'm going to major in aerospace engineering. What am I doing after college? So after the Air Force Academy. I'm going to go to flight training. What are you doing after flight training? I'm going to be a pilot in the United pilot and officer in the United States Air Force. I have an answer for all those questions. And so should you. You need to prepare for what you're going to do because we should be doing ambitious things. And if we're going to be doing ambitious things in the world, we need to be preparing and striving to do it now instead of later. Don't wait till after high school to decide what you're going to do. That's the worst thing you could do for your life. That could ruin your whole life. What are you going to do when you get out of high school and you decide you want to do something ambitious, but it's too late because you waited till you were out of schooling? That'd be a shame. That'd be a shame for you and a shame to your family. Don't be ashamed to your family. Figure out what you're going to do. Venture out into the world. Find out what you love. Find out what... What, what God's purpose for your life was. Find out what you were put on this earth to do. Try new things. Try jujitsu. Try Muay Thai. Try blacksmithing. Try woodworking. Try swimming. Try ice skating. Try figure skating. Try hockey. Try basketball. Try football. Try tennis. Try teaching. Try Being a pilot, try contractor, try being a doctor, try figure out what God's will in your life is. And the way we do this is pray. Pray to the Lord. Lord, reveal to me what your purpose for my life is. Fill me with your spirit and guide me into a path which glorifies you and your creation. Surrender to God's will to your life. I have, and so should you. And for me, I was always afraid of what that will might be. I was completely and utterly afraid that God would want me to be a pastor and because of that I wouldn't be able to go to the Air Force Academy I wouldn't be able to be an officer in the Air Force I wouldn't be able to be a fighter I wouldn't be able to do things I want to do I was completely afraid of that so I never surrendered to God's will for, for my life but one day I was humble before God and I surrendered God even if that means being a pastor even if that means doing something I don't want to do right now I will do, I will, I, I'm surrendering my life to you. And once I did that, I knew I didn't need, I knew I wasn't going to be a pastor. It, even, it solidified my want to go to the Air Force even more. So I know that's God's will for my life. A wise man once said, we shouldn't be afraid for God's will for our lives. We should be afraid of missing it. We shouldn't be afraid of God's will for our lives. We should be afraid of missing, losing. I guess you can't really lose God's will for your life, but you cannot follow it. You cannot obey. So not obeying God's will for your life is one of the greatest mistakes we ever do. Whatever God's will for you is, is where you will find the most achievement, the most happiness, the most fulfillment. Anywhere else, you will not have an as fulfilling life.
And this is the truth. Be ambitious. Shoot for the stars and you'll reach the clouds. Try things. Since every man, young man should learn how to fight, when you are training, when you are doing jujitsu, when you are doing Muay Thai, when you are boxing, when you are doing Taekwondo, whatever fighting style you decide to do, get deep into it. <laughs> get deep into it. Learn well. And maybe that's where you're supposed to be. There's a lot of money in the UFC. Jiu-Jitsu is gradually becoming more popular. I have I have visions for Jiu-Jitsu being extremely popular in the future. That would make me very happy. Try things. Go out of your comfort zone. Explore the world. And you will find what you were meant to do. But don't wait till after high school to figure out what you're going to do. Even if you don't end up doing it, have a plan. Have an ambitious and masculine plan. Always. For everything. Have an ambitious and masculine plan in whatever you do. Be ambitious. Shoot for the stars and you'll reach the clouds. Always. <laughs>